autism. They also be fucking flag no matter fucking what. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you, motherfucker. Fuck you. Ross. Autism. Oh, fuck you. I don't want to in the car. Fucking autism. Oh, oh. Hey, what's going on? Welcome, one and all, to the DSP fandom. Something I had no idea existed till recently when I was at the epicenter of a massive shitstorm. All over this video right here has a deep, deep history of fucking with people who make fun of Phil. Like, say, making fake Photoshop images. How many Shadow Raptor said that was like a Photoshop uh, Discord message? How do you how do you Photoshop a Discord message? I'm mad at you, but I feel angry at Boone, and I feel like I just want to fucking I just want to fucking reveal to the world where he is. Well, wouldn't you look at that? Faking accounts and Photoshopping talks of swatting and death threats and doxing. My my God, what fucking badasses we have here! Now, you're probably wondering, who's that fine gentleman streaming all their fuck-ups and letting us all know that they're big fucking retards? Well, that'd be this guy, Jay Ross. Now, out of the entirety of this autistic group, he would be the most low cowsy of them all. You could milk his ass till the cows come home, if you know what I mean. And we're talking top-tier levels of autistic faggotry, the likes you have never seen. We are talking about someone who gets unfriended on Skype and then, because he has no actual friends, streams himself doxing this guy right here and his girlfriend and threatening to dox both of them. The street you live in, I have that information as well. Yeah, I'm not stopping the stream until until uh, Avalanche is going to fucking tell me why he removed me. So, I even know, uh, just... I know the neighborhood you live in. It's just saved by that. And that's not all. He also loves to pretend he went to war and got PTSD, even though he just turned 18 years old and lives with his fucking grandmother. What a shocker! It's too fuck. Everything is already fucking got to me. It's fucking over for me. It's has got me, and it's fucking. It's... It's fucking over, like I'm gonna get... You're, you're literally 18 years old, Ross. You have the rest of your life ahead of you. Walmart executive, This is, it. this is really... Ross, I'm gonna tell you right now, a lot of things are happening, and it's not, it's not making me happy. I don't, I don't know what's going on, dude. Well, me and Boone were just uh, fucking with some uh, SOK fans. That's really it, really. Oh. Well, it's like, okay. Um, King Paul, is it okay if I say a few words? No, nah, man. I mean, it's, you, you know, you probably got a lot to say since you're more a I part do. of this. And, do, and this is your friends, like, and they just quote, pulled your shit from you. Ross, look, dude, a lot of things are happening, and I'm not, I'm not liking it, dude. I'm not. It's... I, w I really want to get to the bottom of this. That's why I'm here. I could have left a long time ago, but like you need to, I just want to know what's going on. That's it, dude. That's all. So what does that leave us with? What else do we see in this? Well, we got a group of individuals who support a shitty Let's Player, who are also staff members of this shitty Let's Player, who go around lying about others, making fake accounts, fucking with other people, doxing other people, sending loads of death threats, who start operations against others that they think discredit DSP, and live stream all their autism, while also being recorded and made into lol cows behind the scenes. I guess the moral of the story is this. If you're ever enjoying a This Is How You Don't Play, always remember, the DSP fans are fucking worse. You've called the Ginger Boy. All you have to do is Go ahead and basically just go and snap a ginger's head from left to right. Ross here, going ahead. Sometime around mid to late 2017, ahead, King of Pole, or KOP for short, forth, uploaded a video exposing some of the exceptional individuals within the DSP community. The One of these exceptional individuals just so happened to be Jonathan Ross. Their head off and then 
This is the first example I could find of Ross being recognized as a lol cow outside of his small community. Killing gingers. Yeah, but what? When John yeah, said he didn't want the very to fact that you're trying to it. fucking justify for what they did is fucking stupid. Ross, I already told you this. Told me what? They're not gonna live with you? Fine, find someone else to fucking live with then. Ross, I didn't say that. That's up to you. But uh, <laughs> you, you're not. You don't have to hold that against me, Ross, because I have many other people who would. Me too. Neil and Jake and Patrick. Yeah, that's fine. But dude, here's something. Eventually, eventually, dude. Event, eventually, you, the thing is, is that this whole thing against me, like the very fact that you would constantly make fucking posts against me after what what I did with the Jonathan Ross archives, dude. We'll see how long that fucking lasts. What are you talking about? Because you're trying to fucking justify for it, and it's fucking... No, because I was there. You keep telling me I'm not there. I was fucking in the fuck the when it happened. Yeah, you were there, and I... No, stop, dude, here's something. Stop, stop, stop. Because you know Fine. my side of the story. Not, because you know yeah. my side of the story is fact. You've admitted to my side of the story being fact. And now you changed. Yet again. Because Ross, John said he had nothing to do with you. Plus, he can't. And plus, like, he, that whole raiding your thing happened way before then. And he commented once. And I fucking complained about it because I fucking got tired of him raiding my shit. Ross, he raided your thing once. Not just once. Everybody he did it like knows. several fucking times, dude. He, he's he's commented on several. Just because several I raid. said. Oh my god. Just because I said he did it fucking once doesn't mean that it's fucking true. Dude, whenever I over-exaggerate or under-exaggerate, I mean, because well, I misinterpret no. fucking shit. How can you- no, okay, now that's retarded. How can you misinterpret how many times somebody's fucked with you? <laughs> well, you know, it, it's okay for them to fuck with me, but, you know. No, no, it, no, cause you fuck with them too. Yeah. You've, you've raided people's streams before too, Ross, and you thought it was perfectly justifiable to- raid other people's streams who don't like it, but then when someone raids your stream, you can't handle it. What, what videos out there of, of me raiding someone else's stream? There's not any videos, but Ross, you've talked to me about how you and fucking, uh, you and John have raided Twitch streams before. Yeah, but it wasn't like in malicious intent, though. Ross, you were fucking with them. I wasn't even know. fucking with them maliciously. I wasn't fucking Maybe. with them maliciously. Well, John's not fucking with you maliciously when he just says one comment on his- That's bullshit! He did not rave because he- just because he comments one time on a video. Well, he should have commented at all. Ross, it's called freedom of speech. If you don't like it, go to a different country that doesn't have it. But that also means your freedom of speech is taken away too, just to let you know. Well, guess what? It's my fucking channel, not a fucking country, so fuck off with that. It, it, yeah, yeah, but you're in the U.S., and you act like you get the... You know, your YouTube account is within the U.S. jurisdiction. Which means that he can still say all the fucking shit he wants, because he's in the U.S., and so is your account. So, you fuck off. It's gonna be fucking flagged no matter fucking what. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you, motherfucker. Fuck you. Ross, quit freaking out. <sighs> this guy. He's no. He's so primitive. Oh my god. It was around this time on August 27th, 2017, when Ross's former friend Neil created a thread on the popular lol cow forum Kiwi Farms. This thread marked the beginning of the end for Ross. Neil had showcased all of Ross's embarrassing antics, everything from his debate with the SOK, to his doxing, to his rap songs, 
All of it had been condensed into a neat little package and put on display for the public to see. Among this information included something specific that Ross desperately wanted to keep buried. It was an old screenshot from 2016 that was taken from a Discord server. Screenshot read, Yeah, they have already made fun of me for it. I don't want to fuck a kid. I just have feelings for them. I'm getting help through this. Uh, wait, huh? Yo! Yeah, what's, what's going on? What? Dude, some so, dude's fucking. You don't fucking want. I'm I'm sick of this fucking shit. Oh, I'm... What's going on? Dude, you know Bray's the one that fucking started all these fucking allegations. A fucking cunt. Wait, I I've heard just rumors and whatnot. I wasn't there to witness it. I'm just gonna question you now, Ross. What happened? Just tell the truth. I'm not. I'm not accusing you of anything. I'm not gonna ask you what what you did. Just tell me what. Fine, what but don't makes sense don't true. do this. Don't don't act like this whole fake ass fucking psychology shit. All right? Because like no, I'm, dude, just, I'm just saying like what 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 just say like if, if there's anything that's true that they are accusing you, just say just say your side of the story, man. Just say your side. That's all I want to know. Just your side. Dude, I'm dude. I'm only here to speak the fucking truth. But the thing is that they're going they're going on to me. For fucking looking up fucking kids in a bathtub. Like, are you fucking kidding me? How Did is that pedophilia? That? How in the fuck is that pedophilia? Oh, 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 oh. Did you look up kids in a bathtub? I did, but how is that pedophilia? Please provide a fucking example. I, I don't know. It depends on like, what you're looking up for. I mean, I, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna. I don't know, dude. I'm, I'm gonna be a little bit more voice of reason here. God. The the way I view it is sometimes when whether you have autism or you know other mental disorders or illnesses, you're, the way I look at it with those people like that is you're, they're in a world of their own. Therefore, they're in their own set belief where they don't almost don't want to wake up for it. It's like almost like a big dream to them. Um, that's how I view it. And sometimes you have to be harsh. This is my viewpoint. To wake people up. All right, all right, Steve. Just to let you know right now that if Ghostface comes in here, starts like, hey, 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 I'm fucking leaving you. I'm not fucking dealing with this shit. All right, look, it's all right. You can leave if you want, man. But look, what what was your purpose of looking out kids on a bathtub? That's all I want to know. I wanted to have kids myself. What the fuck is so wrong with that? As you look up kids in a bathtub. As I was saying, I, I I don't understand the situation. I don't understand it. Because I wanted the kids myself. I mean, I mean, do no, I need to explain that's, more? That's fine and all, but you have to realize too is that when someone else has kids and they hear oh. you trolling or joking about it, sakes. they may it's not. Shady. They, it's just shady, Roz. Like it, that's all it is. It's just a shady thing. Not, parent, parents on public may not see it as that. That's what John and Tina were trying to say. I don't care what they think, but the thing is, though, here's something, right? It, say that, say that, all right? Well, all right. here's something, right? Is I don't deserve to be on the fucking registry, first of all, because I never fucking did anything wrong to begin with. All right. And I never fucking did any fucking crimes at all, so... Oh, we know that. We know that. We know that. I don't that. see that. But... But also, what John was trying to say too, and I've read this elsewhere as well, that sometimes one of my point of view though well, is well, that he's fucking trying to say that pretty much I'm just a fucking guy that wants to go ahead and fucking uh, and is gonna do is gonna act upon these fucking urges one day. What fucking urges? What fucking urges are is that motherfucker even talking done. about? But like John was saying, okay. Sometimes your brain makes you think cer thinks you certain ways, and John, I think he was trying to do more good and advice for you, because if you have something else besides autism, you need to go, it doesn't hurt to go get help, I'm sure James can agree, it does not hurt. Yeah. Um, what you tell, you just gotta watch what you tell people, because people will twist your words, 
make you seem bad. Maybe Roz, you were just looking up kids in a bathtub. I, I don't. I don't know why you would look it up. Honestly, I. I. You have your own reasons. Nefarious fucking uh, means of any lust or anything like that. Because. Well, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not saying that you are. I'm not saying that. I. I know. I. I just have no desire to look that up. You know. Maybe you were curious about, like, you know, wanting to have kids on your own or something like that. I'm not. I don't. I'm not going to say what your reason was. I don't know. But you can't well, tell people that on like the internet, especially in all this drama stuff. Because. Yeah, I, I know, I know that, I I know, and the thing is, is that, like, you just took the words out of my mouth, it was because I was curious about fucking having, like, kids myself, so. Yeah, I, I you know, it's, it, that's perfectly fine, I guess, I mean, honestly, if you don't know, if you're curious, then it's, it's perfectly fine to look that up, but you just can't tell people that stuff, because all they're gonna do, Ross, is just make you look like, you know, the bad guy, they're, making, they're gonna make you look like a pedo, they're gonna make you, you know, just look bad, and then it's gonna be a tough, whenever someone actually questions you about it, it's and gonna I be think, tougher. And I think that's what John was also trying Shut to get at. Shut the fuck up, Tina. Yeah. Wait, is what? that, you know, is that, um, John was probably trying to tell you that you shouldn't be seeing things like that publicly. For the exact reasons James just said. There's nothing illegal about it, though. As far as I know, there's not, but, you know, it, it, like, like, you have to look at it from Tina's perspective. She's a parent. Um, and I know how parents are. Exactly. And, you, you, like I said earlier, if there is something else wrong, there's, it, it, you don't have to feel ashamed of going, you know, talking to someone. But that doesn't mean that, that, you know, she had the right to fucking diagnose me as a fucking pedophile because... First off, like, I'm not a pedophile, there's no proof I'm a pedophile, you know? People may take things out of fucking context, but doesn't mean I'm a fucking pedophile. Yeah, yeah, people take stuff out of context, people twist the people take stuff the wrong way. We can't help that, Ross, it's just how people are, it's just human nature. Someone hears that you're looking up kids in a bathtub, they're immediately gonna think, wow, that guy's a creep. That's all they're gonna think, dude. No one's gonna think, oh, okay, maybe he's looking them up for... You know, maybe when he, when he have, has kids one day, you know you know what I mean? No one thinks that as their first instinct. Their first initial reaction as a, as a normal human being just is took the be, words out of my fucking mouth. It's just going to be, wow, he's a pedophile. That's all they're going to think, man. The guy, essentially, they're going to think of you as... Hey, you know, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hey, Brady, right here. Bro, let's talk about that shit you were talking yesterday. <laughs> Bro, you were talking all that shit yesterday. Oh, my God. Go Say it now. the fuck up, you Fucking yeah, yeah. You want to go to your fucking little faggot ass motherfucker? You fucking first off, it's Cuban. You go. Okay, calm down. Shut up, Ross. Shut, shut up. Ross, shut up. Just let go speak real quick. I, I had to I'll let you speak. Something. Okay, let ghost go. Just let ghost go. Go. Well, well, hold on, hold on, hold on. You autistic fuck. How about you talk shit now? Instead of coming on Cougar's show on a million accounts, what you gotta say, you pussy boy. You want to talk shit to me? Dave fuck you, faggy. Blah blah blah. What does that I have to do with way. me, bruh? What does that have to do with you me? You were in my fucking stream and I had a fucking block. Nah, I'm a, no, I wasn't. No, I wasn't. Now I'm, yeah, yeah, yeah. now I'm a Puerto Rican faggot. Now I'm a Puerto Rican faggot, right? Yeah. So okay, now you're sure. a homophobe. You, you can you can lie. Now you can you're a homophobe. Lie. How is that homophobe? Now you're you homophobe. Fucking dumb fuck. You're such a dumb fucking. You're such a dumb. Guys, chill, 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 chill. Yeah, it's calm down. Just call me a faggot. Isn't it a faggot? Uh, Dude, this shit's gonna go on for like the entire stream. I'm fucking done. And fuck you, goes. Triggered. Uh, yeah. Winning, bitch. Fuck off. I, we're, what me and Goats are just trying. I mean, uh, what me and Steve are just trying to explain them about the uh, whole kids in the bathtub thing, which is like you can't tell like, if you are looking that shit up. You can't tell people that you're looking that shit up. I don't know why he would want to tell them out of all people. And 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 Roz, I, I want to make something clear. Yeah, I was in your stream. Hey, hey, time. Ghost, Ghost. You say I don't have a fucking camera. But we'll put, fucking turn it on then. You fucking faggot. Turn it on. Look, okay, I'll turn it on right now. Yeah, yeah turn it on. We'll see. See, you Xbox. Don't have no camera. Okay, you don't have a cell phone, sir? I don't even have a fucking cell phone at all. Ah, that's bullshit. Oh, yeah, of course, even though I have a flip phone, but you know. Oh, you have a flip phone, sure. I'm talking my shit right fucking now, Ghost. This is what Ghost wants, so I'm giving I'm you. Sure. I'm sure. I'm sure. I'm sure, bro. Are you Googled any uh, kids lately? Today? Shut the fuck up, Ghost. <laughs> I, uh, I was just to shut up. I'm asking you a question. Pile of fucking trash. Oh, so see you're being racist now. 
I'm not even racist. What what racial fucking thing did I ever say just now? That's um pretty much a racial slur. How? Why do you have to involve being fuck. Cuban or Puerto Rican? What does that have to do with anything? What is it? What what nation? Okay. What does my nationality have to do with it? You have to add that. That would be like Tina, you a stupid in. fucking Muslim fuck. Why why does that have to do with anything? Just call me a dumb fuck. What what does that have to do with anything, dude? Yeah. Okay. I'm asking you. What does it have to do with anything that you had to throw that in? Like you felt a need to throw that in. Puerto Rican, Cuban. Well, guess what? Talking shit so, on the internet. Do you have Do you have something against? You. Do you have something against like Puerto Rican, Cuban people that you had to add it in? That's like how Chad was when Chad had to go, Brig, you fucking nigger. Like, why did you have to throw in Cuban, Puerto Rican? As much as I don't what, fucking what? like Chad, dude, that was fucking amazing. Oh, that was amazing. See, you are oh, racist. you're fucking racist, bro. That's racist See, as shit. you are, dude. She's not even fucking black, you fucking dumb fuck. Bro, you just said it was amazing that Chad calls someone a nigger. Chad are you called, fucking wait, kidding wait, That's Briggs fucking racist. Black? Fucking, fucking, br fucking, if Chad fucking called Briggs that, then that's unjustified. I just but said he calls that, a white you person amazing. Thing. You just said it was amazing. I said Chad, just like Chad oh called Briggs. Why, 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 why is Chad called? Pushing my fucking words now. No, no, no. Look, no, wait, hello. you can rewind it. You can rewind oh, it. I said no, just no, like Br Br Chad called Briggs a nigger. You said oh, if you hey, said up, that, that's bag, amazing. Fuck fucking titty whore motherfucker. What's up? Hey, bitch, I'm bitch, so beat the fuck yeah, out of you. You already know that. No, 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 you shut the fuck up, you fucking faggot ass motherfucker. You already know that. Call me a fucking white girl. Call me a fuck. Hey, bruh. Fucking white girl ass motherfucker faggot ass bitch. Call me a spick. Call me a spick, Ryan. Don't try dare you. Call me a spick. Call me a spick. Tell me to go back to Cuba. Tell me to get on the raft. I know you're getting close to that point, yeah, dude. Yeah, how about you I go you're... fucking kill yourself? Yeah. How about that, you yeah. fucking faggot? Oh, Take oh, a fucking noose oh. and fucking kill yourself, fucking faggot-ass motherfucker. Whoa, whoa. No, I'm fucking done. Kill whoa, yourself. feeling edgy, huh? You know what? Honestly, like, Edward does have a point. To an extent. But now this is my fucking stream. You think you could talk shit to me? Think you could fuck with me? Think you could do all that shit? Well, guess what, motherfucker? You can't. <laughs> uh, Twenty-two people watching. So you want me to tell tell uh, all the shit I have on you? Cause I can't, and I will. So, guess what, ghost? And guess what? You're fucked. Unless you can fuck talk to me rationally, you're fucked. Don't fuck with me. Because this is just what fucking happens. I could literally... Dude, people are puppets on a fucking string to me. And guess what? This all played out exactly how I fucking planned. So yeah. Like I said. I'm the one that's always fucking winning. He's such a pussy, man. Such a fucking pussy. That fucking pedophile. You're not fucking winning shit, pussy. Oh, what a fucking pussy, man. Well, as a matter of fact, I'm about to get my stream back right now. Watch this shit. Watch this shit. Oh my god, because I can't add myself? It's fucking dumb. Oh well. Fuck it, man. I'm, I'm back. It won't even let me add myself. Fucking swoop. Oh, I planned all this. You fucking pedophile, bro. You're a pedophile, man. A big pedophile. Big time. Big time. Oh, well. I'm stuck. But. Yeah, someone who watches kids in the bathtub will never win, man. But we're gonna start a new stream, man. New one, man. Big time. And stuff. And look at me, Roz, you pussy. You fucking P.O. looking motherfucker. You fucking kid looking in the bathtub, bitch. Pussy ass motherfucker. I own you, pussy. And I own this stream, and it's my stream. Hey, you can kick me out. You can kick all of us out, man. Fuck you, though. Eddie, you're a retard, man. Retard. Thinking that we're.
You shut the fuck up, you fucking flamboyant fucking fat. Regular users of Kiwi Farms were now intrigued. From this point on, things would only get worse for Ross. The amount of notoriety he was receiving would only grow over time, as more and more people began to pay attention to him. As a response to this attention, Ross began doing more videos and more live streams. Consistently digging himself a deeper hole, Ross tried frantically to defend himself from the accusations of pedophilia, all while trying to maintain his overall innocence. But in the end, such efforts would prove to be ineffective. On August 29, 2017, popular internet troll Mr. Mediker somehow stumbled upon one of Ross's live streams. I can't seem to find the beginning of the stream anywhere, but luckily everything after Jim arrives was archived. I just happened upon a live stream, a live stream that he and his friends were doing, and I kid you not, I swear to fucking God, this is the first thing that he said. This is the exact moment that I turned this live stream on. Yeah, but you could say I'm a pedophile all you want, but I'm not a pedophile. Have, have you talked Dude. to Rex lately? Yeah, I have. But how the fuck is looking that shit up not messed up? Dude, you fucking- Dude, looking up kids in the bathtub isn't fucking pedophilia. The only reason why it's pedophilia if you jerk off to it. I didn't even jerk off to it at all. Like, that's what's fucking stupid about it. You literally said you have feelings for children, and that you need help. Ross, uh, you're hello? retarded. Wait. Brandon, talk, bitch! Dude, is this fucking Medica? Are you actually in the call? Side oh, so, I, I was listening to the live stream, and I, I was just kind of curious about the bathtub stuff. No, it's Ross, you. you wanna- you wanna oh, back that okay, story up a little bit to the bathtub with the kids? This is getting Holy really shit. bad. There's over What's 100 up, people man? in here. Yeah, Ross, well, can, you tell, are you gonna... can you tell me about the little kids in the bathtub? <laughs> before <laughs> you do- before I do that- before I do that, are you gonna go make a video about me? I really hope you do, man. Well, I'm, I'm- I'm vaguely familiar with you. I mean, I've seen a few videos of you, uh, that are getting passed around of, like, uh, freaking out Ross, on Skype calls and, and weird shit like that. No, he's um, speaker, like right? one with, with your with your grandma yelling at you, and like another one where you like just start screaming at people. That's all I know about you. But I've been stumbled across the street when you're talking about little kids in bathtubs, so that's kind of what I'm curious about. Oh, hey, Mediker, there's a. Uh... Hey, before I say anything, here before I say anything, it's an honor to have you as a guest uh, on here, anyways. That's I don't an really honor. care. Yeah, it's an honor to have him. Well, okay, for me. that's great. Can you tell me about the little kids in the bathtub, Ross? That's all I want to just... Oh, yeah. Serious. Who no, is this dude, anyway? I'll explain. I'll explain. Here's something, right? I'm a Jesuit he's, priest. He's, Come he's, to spread the word of Jesus. Go ahead, Ross. He's cool as fuck. Dude, alright. God. Anyways, um... Pretty much the reason why is because... You know, I, I looked it up and I thought they were cute videos. That's really it. See, I thought the naked kids in the bathtub were cute. What made you man told you to look up fucking you're like you thought that was cute? Why were you looking up naked kids in bathtubs in the first place, Ross? Uh because I wanted to fucking uh find I I thought like why not? Like are you kidding me? Like dude, this is like <laughs> so just randomly like, one day you're like, I'm gonna look up way, naked Medicare, kids. He always you gotta know, you gotta know on it's this. something, right? Like, he you gotta know it's this. something, right? No, you got you got fucking Ross. labelized. Oh yeah. I'm asking you a simple question, Ross. Why are you looking up naked kids in a bathtub? Um Pretty much uh what, you mean why what's the reason why? Well because like I said, dude, like I thought they were cute. That's the reason why, dude. Like why do you why do you have to go into this so much? Really? Because you're on a live stream talking about naked children in bathtubs, Ross. That's kinda fucking weird. And you're like, well you thought they were cute. That's not like a normal that's not like a normal adult thing to say, oh is it? Oh my god, that, you, you can't be you can't be taking it that way, dude. Like, are you serious? Well, how would I take it? You're a grown man saying you're looking up fucking videos of naked kids in bathtubs because they're cute. Well, how how should I take it? I don't know. Like, pretty much, pretty much. Like, I guess, like, fucking, I want to have kids myself. Maybe I don't uh, Pepe, know. Pepe, no one wants to <laughs> did, talk to a dead meme. So go back so to your did, grave. So did you think that looking at naked children would help you? <laughs> you help you create them? Like, how does that? What do you? Uh, how does wanting to have kids correlate to looking them up naked? Well, I saw, I thought they were fun videos. That's really it, dude. Like, if you want to go, if you want to go, how? Uh, are you fucking kidding me? Like, I'm asking you, you a straightforward question. You, you're, you're wondering. 
It's all, and plus, even then, it's not even illegal at all. Like, are you kidding me? I'm not even, I don't even care about the legality of it. I'm just asking how- I'm not really how. triggered. You're just annoying and you're dead. Hey, Ross, if you delete this, I gotta record it. So, yeah. Hey. That's fine. I don't, you can, can re-upload it or whatever the fuck. I don't care about you guys either. This is going on the Kiwi thread. Yeah, the fucking Medicare is on here, dude. What's up, man? Yeah, I think yeah, the chat's, up, the chat's, black, the chat's fascinated with this too, Ross. Like, uh, people people want to know. I so, want to know too. What, <laughs> how, cute, how, what, get, like, explain it, walk me through it. Hey, cool man. You can't do that without <laughs> oh, him, yeah. like, admitting to being a pedo. Like, what's the thing? Any no, it's not that, no, it's not that. It's just that I thought they were cute because, you know, they were, it was fun to watch the videos like that's really it really like are it's you fun like a roller coaster ride i don't really care about him he's just playing a video game on one how exactly and i don't even know who this fucker is yeah who, who, you, you're asking who the fuck i am i'm the guy talking to the pedophile I, Why I'm you shut the fuck up and let me do I'm that on the, i'm on the i'm on the internet well, i don't I'm thousand k subscribers i'm mr medicare i'm a cool guy oh, no, you're gonna the roast guy mr medicare talking about naked kids in a bathtub ross that's well, your dumbass so why don't you answer the question rather than being a little bitch <laughs> ross you don't want to go against mr medicare man that's gonna be the most retarded thing you did ever <laughs> People oh, gonna dude, fucking against me already. I don't give a fuck. You're already on Nobody's Kiwi Farms. Stop digging your own grave. Look at naked kids on the internet, Ross. That's all. We're just curious. Ross, you're literally fucking well, your own I, life I, up I, right I, now. As well as, that, as well as that, uh, because like, due to the very fact, I don't care, boo. Anyways, uh, pretty okay. much like, you, what's funny? Um, what's funny about that is that. I'm mad, dude. Yeah, exactly. But um. Pretty much, like, uh, what's funny about it is that, like, people say that pretty much it's it's pedophilia when you gotta look at, at it this way, right? Is pretty much, it, it was pretty much, like, it was it was pretty much cute, pretty much. It was also uh, a reminder that you, that, like, when you were, when you were younger yourself, and, yeah, I mean, how the fuck is that, like, you know, oh, yeah, I want to jerk off to fucking the innocence of youth. How in the fuck? <laughs> well, that's your phrasing, not mine. Uh, when I was a kid, I didn't think about grown men watching me take baths, but, I mean, well, apparently that's what here's you would the, Here's the fucking, here's the fucking thing. Welcome, bro. But you haven't Brandon, explained you're, you're saying side fun side and cute. How? How exactly? Uh, pretty much, what you mean? Like, I need to, like, in-depth explain or something? No, you need to give a reasonable explanation why a grown man is watching videos of naked children in bathtubs other than, I thought it was fun and it was cute. That's fucking weird, right? Or is everybody else fucked in this going to act like that's not, not fucking weird? It's not the only thing fucked up he's done either. He's doxxed people, he's death threaded, he's fucking false DMCA'd my fucking shit, and he <laughs> said that my channel is going down unless I fucking make amends with this psychopath. Yeah, I want a little bit more in-depth. I'm just curious. Like I said, I stumbled on your fucking stream right as you said that, so that caught my attention. I'm just really curious. When you say fun and cute, like, how is that fun and cute? It's fun and cute for its dick. Uh, no, not really, because, like, dude, like, it's just, like... I don't, I don't know, dude. Like, you're expecting me to go in-depth with this, like... Because the motherfucker wants kids. Jesus Christ. How, what the fuck is that? He wants, he wants kids. Oh, he wants kids, so he looks up naked videos of children. What are you fucking kidding me? No, Ross. How exactly was it fun and cute? Let Brandon talk, you motherfucker. Shut oh, up, you stupid fucking hole. Oh, Nobody wants to listen to you. Somebody muzzle hey, this. Oh my god, god. Oh, 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 Brandon, oh, get this little motherfucker. Oh my god, Edge Queen, you're not edgy at all. You're fucking annoying. Yeah, 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 yeah. You yammer too much. Shut the fuck up. Oh Bernie, you're the, you're the annoying piece of shit who thinks he's so because he's cool on the internet. But, 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 but stutter some more, you dumb bitch. I see you in the chat trying to be funny like you know fucking memes and shit. You're so out of touch. You call yourself Edge Queen. There's nothing edgy about you. You fucking hole. You don't, you don't, don't know fucking know. Her. You don't know. Yeah, exactly. You don't really I don't, don't need to know her. her. She's annoying and unfunny. Ross, why are you a pedophile? How about you answer that simple question? You're trying to twist it like it's not normal. Are you fucking kidding? It me? isn't normal, you fucking degenerate. Edge Queen, do you, you know gotta know it's funny. You, you gotta know it's funny. Right? You, after I'm what you said to me, why should I answer you? you? Oh, so you're gonna shut up now? Well, thanks for taking the advice. Jesus Christ, you dumb bitch. Oh, call me a dumb bitch one more time. Dumb bitch. Dumb cunt, whatever. I don't give a fuck. 
You're all dumb bitches. Why? Ross, why are you looking at pictures of naked kids on the internet? Brandon, I am not dumb. Uh, except, <laughs> yeah, exactly. Ruby isn't dumb. Um, but yeah, you don't. Yeah, you don't think I'm dumb when? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, she knows psychology. That's the thing, really. So. <sighs> yeah, but. But anyways, um. Wait, what was that question again, Medigar? Why? Okay, you're saying it's fun and cute. Okay. I'm not asking for the most in-depth explanation on Earth. I, I, maybe you can explain it away and make it sound reasonable. Like I said, I only stumbled on the stream right as you said that. So when because you say they're kind of like cute, dog and cat videos, that's why. So naked kids in bathtubs are like dog and cats videos. Well, yeah. I mean, like, you, like I know you're ignorant and all that shit. Like, oh, I'm have, totally like, ignorant. He's just ignorant. Okay, Michael Jackson, keep hey, going. Keep hey, going. Hey, Medicare, King of Poles, gonna come in here. <laughs> You're gonna disrespect Michael, dude, dude. So you're gonna have a gang bang against me, okay? Well, pretty much. Uh, what do you want? <laughs> no, really. What do you want? Uh, can you? Are you gonna say something, or are you gonna be a fucking autistic retard? Who are you talking to? Are you talking to me? Oh uh, yeah, I, I am. Well, what Jesus. are you doing? What are you doing right now? Uh, I don't know. Fucking being Stop. fucking. Like, you... holy fuck, Ross, you gotta stop, dude. You gotta stop. Like, you're, you're like way out there right now. I'm, st I'm like literally streaming, and like these, these fuckers come in. What am I supposed to do? Stop, stop this, this whole fucking mess. And I don't even understand. There's pedo allegations now. I, I didn't even know this about you, Ross. The, the amount of time that I don't know. Murphy have have talk to you and been around you. I've never heard this well, they fuck. never told you about the pedophile allegations and probably due to the very fact that maybe because they're lying, so Well, okay, I mean, like, do you like kids? What, uh Uh, I don't like them that way just so you know What is that? Okay, so how do you like children? Rex? I think they're, they're... Hey, Rex, there's a Kiwi Farms uh, thread with uh, evidence of your pedophilia mate, so... Everybody, a, everybody, everybody mute, lying. everybody mute. Uh, me and King of Pole are talking right now. Okay. How does wanting kids relate to you going on the internet and looking at naked children? How does, how does the, how do they connect it exactly? What, how does that play into each other? Uh, and you want to know why I said it was fun? Sure. Because, well, because honestly, like, you know, like, the thing is, is that, like, they're playing and shit, and they're and they're pretty much chilling, and that's pretty much what it is, really. I mean, do you want me to explain it a little bit more? I mean, I mean, they're, I mean, it's like it's like pretty much two innocent kids just playing it, playing in the bathtub, pretty much. And that's really it. Oh, okay. That doesn't describe. That doesn't describe me fucking having any sexual inter, like fucking like actual what, what fucking. Er earlier, Ross, when they were saying that you you had said you had feelings for children and you needed help, is there, are they lying? Pretty much what I, what I mean by that is I mean like, pretty much what I mean by that simply is that pretty much like I have feelings for kids meaning the very first explanation meaning that I wanted to have kids myself. Okay, okay Jim, for your clarification, this click in the chat and see where I just linked that Discord picture, that is verbatim what he said, specific. Can, can, you, just, can you just read it? I don't want to click a bunch I, of fucking links. So I read it earlier. He says, and this was in 08, 12, 2016. This was a year ago. So you've had these feelings for a year. Wow. Uh, yeah, they have already made fun of me for it. He's uh, talking about the pedophilia. I don't want to fuck a kid. I just have feelings for children or for them. Uh, I'm getting help. I'm getting help through this. I mean, as in somebody is assisting him for his sexual urges, I'm assuming sexual, it comes off that way, for his urges when it comes for feelings towards children, but he, he hmm. So Ross, I mean, it feels like you, you not only like bought the rope and tied the noose, but like put your neck in it. Like you, you're admitted that you're looking at naked kids on the internet, and then there are these conversations where you're saying you have feelings for kids and you need to get help. So like, let's just cut through this shit and get to brass tacks. Are you, are you a pedophile? I'm not saying you acted on it, but are you? No, not really, and I, I didn't even act on anything, really. I, no, I said that. I'm not saying that you acted on it. I'm just saying, is is that what this is? Because everybody's talking about it now, so not if it is, you might I, as well I'm just come like, clean with it. Well, except I'm not. Like, you could say that millions of times that, you know, I am, but I'm really not. 
you get that why people would think this is weird, right? Like why most people I know why think... people would think it's weird, dude. I get that every fucking day of my life, dude. Like, you tell people kidding? every day that you like looking at naked children no, on the internet? I would suggest no. not doing that. <laughs> that no, I, 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 I'm not saying it like, oh yeah, I, I, I fucking tell it every day. No, it's because it's due to the very fucking fact that pretty much I get that every day anyways. Why do, get, why do you get that every day? I, I guess I don't because know. Because people think it's fucking weird, just like how some... Because like, even weird. though it's out of context. But, okay, why. but even, no, what I'm saying is, even in context, it's, it's fucking weird. Yeah. I know, but, but it's mostly out of context, though. What are you talking about? What I'm talking about is the fact that you're talking about looking up fucking naked kids on the internet, and then, like, acting like... That somehow was related to you wanting to have children, and that that's totally normal. It's it's not totally normal. It's the opposite of normal. Okay. If you notice, everybody in this call right well, now, you don't up, know. none of them have none of them have backed you up. None of them have said, "Yeah, it's normal to do that." Because well, it's they, so, fucking. Oh, well, well, if you're if you're talking about people about nobody backing me up, Brandon Ruby. And yeah, stupid Brandon Ruby. For do that. you look at naked children on the internet? You want to jump in? No, it's not that. No, but but whatever. You know, I'm twisted. Brandon, but, like, do you have anything to say? Because people keep telling me to shut up. Meh. Great. Yeah, okay, so Ross, that silence speaks volumes, wouldn't you say? <laughs> no, it no it's because it's just meh. Yeah, exactly. Like, you, like. I mean, there's not really much that I can fucking add in with the shit fest that's going on. So just continue. Okay. Well, there you go, Ross. They left you to hang out to dry. Not really. No, I'm just saying there's so, nothing. You, okay, well, not really then. Well, Some friends you have, Ross. <laughs> oh my fucking friend. Yeah, your friends left no, you out to hang out to dry. They won't say it, Ross. They can dance around it, but they're not going to fucking say it. Brandon, Brandon just, just Brandon, just say, just, just say what you have to say to him. I'll, yeah. I'll just like get it over with. I bet even they think you're weird, Ross, because you are. No, they, they don't think I'm weird, and Ruby doesn't even think I'm weird at all, dude. <laughs> I, like, I'm literally not Dead silence, weird. Ross. Dude, Dead she didn't even silence. fucking answer your question. Oh because my God. people are talking. Yeah, fucking answer the goddamn question. Well, way too many people are talking. Alright, alright, Ruby, just yeah, talk to Mr. Medica. Everyone... Ruby, just say something to to Medica, alright? If you um, don't know who Medica is, he's Brightside Bob. Was he the one who was bitch talking? Yeah, pretty much. Okay. Yeah, no, that's been me the whole time. I, it, just, just one simple question, I guess, Rudy or Ruby or whatever. Do you think it's normal to look at naked children on the internet? Um, I, I don't think it. Most people do it, but I don't think Ross is a pedophile. That's not what I asked. Do you think it's normal to look up naked pictures of children on the internet? See, you're baiting here. I'm asking you, you a straightforward know. question. Don't dance around it. Yes or no? Do you think it's normal to look up naked pictures of children on the internet? Simple. Yes or I no? I don't know what normal is. So you don't want to answer the question? I don't know. You won't let me give any nuance. I, there's no nuance here. It's a simple straightforward There's always yes no. nuance, dude. Oh, okay. What circumstances would it be normal for a grown or an 18-year-old man to be looking up naked pictures of children on the internet and then tell people Okay, this is what I think. I think Ross didn't think it was weird when he was doing it. And he saw it on YouTube and he was like, oh, like, I, I can't wait to have kids and have them play around like that. And stuff like that. I really don't think he had any sexual urges towards the children. I mean, then, talking then to just him. Just look at him on. A, talking just look to him, at him quite, in a playground playing or something, not in a bathtub. What the fuck? Well, like, what? I mean, like, does it make a difference? I mean, does it make a difference? Those, those videos are up. On, naked, those yes. videos are up on YouTube for people to watch. Oh, I'm gonna be right. a motherfucker through but you can still try uh, i'm letting you talk i'm not interrupting you go ahead fine he has he has problems with communicating and what and when you have problems with communicating with what ross has things could come out really wrong and really messed up sounding here, and i believe that is what happened here, i'm sorry to cut you off ruby the thing is this like this is the internet like people don't care about other people's problems yes they, they do really like Children. They really don't. They really don't care. So like, they can, they can like fucking. No, 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 no. Let me talk. Let me talk. Is that simply? 
pretty much, is that they don't care about people's problems or disabilities or whatever. They don't really care. They they single them out as lol cows or something like that because honestly, and then there are some people who have disabilities that don't get under the radar of lol cows or something like that, Ruby. Yeah, call That's, him a fucking freak one more time and you're banned, fucker. Uh, so, Ross, here's the problem with that, is your history on the internet is filled with extreme toxic and criminal behavior. Like, you have sent death threats, you faked accounts in order to harm people, you have openly doxxed at least a dozen people, you have sent a ton Wait, of how shit, is, how is creating your fake account you break the law sometimes. How is creating fake ac accounts against the law? I didn't say that, I, I said that's criminal behavior. I understand that you don't understand what that means, but you do malicious shit on the internet on a regular, constant basis. This isn't like the right, first time down. you've done something ridiculous. I want to address the I want to address that one the one rumors about me is the whole PTSD thing. Well, right? you know, I don't really care about that. That's like a drop in the bucket. You've got you got child, you got child. Well, no, 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 Paul, Paul, let him, let him. I, I want to hear the explanation. I've heard that video where you claim to have PTSD. So you go ahead and give us your explanation. I, I made a video about it. Oh, we saw the PTSD video. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, here we go. Wait, you just laughed. Uh, Boone and, and and Neil, but they're fucking idiots. Just ignore them. Um, let me see. Let me let me go to a tweet that I did. Um, it said bullying, child abuse, loss of those that you care about. It's not just me lying about going to war. The fact that I would lie about having PTSD, and that's really the end of the tweet I did today. Oh, so, okay, that doesn't really give me. Did, wait, did you claim that you went to war and had PS, or PTSD? Because that's what the video. No, he did not. Exactly, I didn't. No, he just said he had PTSD. Yeah, yeah, you guys inflated it to he went to war. PTSD is not just a war. No, Brian like, did. I, Bri well, I never, yeah, never. Yeah, well, how do you have PTSD? Oh, you can go back to the Edgelords on the Hunt video. Let's go back to that video. Why don't you go watch my Edgelords on the Hunt video again? You, yeah. you definitely claimed you had PTSD. Everybody in the call had to tell you that you're not yeah, I do have PTSD. in the war. I do have PTSD. Oh, you want to know what? Shit. You wanna know what? You wanna know you wanna know what's funny about that? Is that I didn't say I went to war at all. I didn't I never I would never steal valor at all. Like what in the fuck is wrong with you? Ross, we've established that. We're saying you uh, okay, Ross, so why do you have PTSD oh then if it's not stolen valor? Because because it's <laughs> it's through uh, being bullied in real life and online, it's also child abuse that oh I had to go God. through no longer and if loss anyone of those laughs I care at about. That, I that is oh, not okay, exactly. Ross, so walk me through this then. You you say you have PTSD from being bullied online, and yet you make death threats against people and dox them. Let so, me, let me, I, yeah. you know, I've noticed too that you seem to have a lack of empathy. Have you ever been diagnosed as a sociopath? He does not uh, no, have a lack because, of empathy. Yeah, I remember Neil I was saying it's a sociopath earlier. For, uh, I, dude, I, dude, I, I am a very empathetic person, and I know he does not have a lack of empathy. I mean, he has I, autism. I don't understand what a sociopath is. I, I asked you, I said, you, you seem to exhibit some of the traits. I, I remember another call, too, where uh, it was leaked online, where your grandmother, uh, I believe it was your grandmother, uh, and you had an argument. And uh, you told her to fuck off, and you two told each other you hated each other. But a few of the things she said struck me, and that kind of ties into your talking about why well, PTSD, because I was bullied, but then you're bullying and doxing other people. She said that you didn't bathe. Uh, that you weren't a clean person uh and, and i know like some of these that's why i'm curious like have you been diagnosed with either sociopathy or maybe schizophrenia no. like type 2. no i mean like not not really like i mean i did have like schizophrenia in the past but not anymore oh it just cleared up <laughs> i mean dude i don't have sociopathic traits though so you're schizophrenic though and uh, schizophrenia wouldn't make you a sociopath I said it could be either or. Keep up with me here. So, Ross, you, you were you are schizophrenic. Uh, pretty much I used to be when I was a teen. I mean, well, he admitted to what, me. What do you mean? Wait, you yeah. used to be. Do you have some homeopathic uh, remedy that the world doesn't know about? Because people would pay a lot of money for that. May May I say something? Uh, Ross actually very recently, within like the past month or two, admitted to me that he has voices in his head. I don't know if I recorded it or... Uh, except I don't even have voices in my head. They constantly but, but, understand they talk to him. Oh, now you're back. 
but you, but you told me that you do have voices in your head that tell you to do shit. So legit. Oh yeah, you mean oh yeah, you mean that one time. Well, here's here's the I mean, thing. See, right? there you go. You just confessed to it. That doesn't. That still that still doesn't make you like fucking like have ultimate hallucinations at all. Like that's not the okay. biggest. That's not like the most craziest thing you ever fucking had in your life. Like, what the fuck are you even talking about? Like, yeah, okay, but you don't. You want. You want to know what? Honestly, Boone. Like, I. I really do not care what people really think about me to begin with. Yeah, you do. That means you care. You a lot. do. No, Boone. You do care about. And you know what? You actually did backstab and and talk shit about a lot of fucking people, Boone. So don't fucking okay, lie. Okay, well, great. Boone's a piece of shit. That we've established that. That's fantastic. Yeah. I'm, Already, though. Okay, but you're saying that you don't have schizophrenia anymore, but you did have it. It just cleared up. Pretty much, I don't have schizophrenia not anymore. What do you mean, pretty much? Yes or no? Is it gone, or do you still have it? It's gone. Okay. I do have medication. And, and Ross doesn't even know what medication he takes. That's been confirmed. Yeah, I really don't know, and I don't really care, really. Well, that's another thing that confuses me, Ross. In that call with your grandmother, you said, I can live on my own, I'm responsible, I can take care of myself, but you don't even know what medicine you're on. How the fuck can you take care of yourself? Yeah, all I have to do is just ask my grandmother, what medicine do I take, but I really don't care to well, do you so, told her because to I do yourself. it every day. You, you she won't even you tell want. you. Uh, we all say, we all say things that we don't mean. What the fuck are you talking about? Oh, I'm saying that you've got a really short fuse, and multiple calls have been leaked with you screaming I nonstop and bashing and hitting shit. What? Huh? What? I can what? see what this dude is doing. He comes in here like he's a big badass and controls your stream. No, Are you badass. talking about me? Uh, about mm. most of you people, like Boone and Medicare. <laughs> okay, then. I mean, the guy who just randomly popped in. Oh, the guy that randomly popped in. Yeah, that's Gerpy. Which, which which guy? Gerpy? No, not Gerpy. I don't I, think Gerpy said. He didn't much. randomly pop in. He wanted in, so I gave him. Why don't you say their name then? Why why be passive aggressive about it? Just say who you're talking I'm, about. I don't know your fuck. There's so many fucking people. Me, in then. Then. Just say you. There's you like do. Okay, bright. Cool need they to are shut bright. Up. Just say me. Okay, bright. That, you. That's Jim. That's is that dumb. how you treat a lady, dude? Really? That's not a lady. That's a dumb cunt. That's, that's how you treat a hole. <laughs> oh, yeah, God. If you tell them to shut the fuck up, they're the, that's where comedy goes to die. <laughs> all right, all right. You oh, can boy. insult me all you fucking want, but okay, if you insult one I'll of my fucking you. friends, okay, okay, I don't. I'll insult you. <laughs> hey, you yeah. Okay. So keep saying what, are you, what are you gonna do, Ross? You're gonna cry <laughs> about it. Hey, he might. Oh, he actually Probably had a video where he cried. Have you seen that, Medicare? Yeah. Brandon. You, you're yeah, going to break your you keyboard and call your grandmother a fucking whore and then not bake her uh, for a week and a half, Ross? Is Medi that what you're going to do? Hey, Medicare, have you seen the video where he cries and on live stream? And then in your head. Of course he has. Oh, yes. Yeah, I've seen all the videos. This guy's a fucking... Geez, he's out of his fucking gourd. Is he lying? I don't know. He's looking up naked pictures of the kids on the internet. He hears voices. He fights with his grandma. He breaks shit. He doxes people. He sends death threats to people. And then there are people on this call trying to defend that shit and act like it's normal. You fucking lying cunts. You know that's not normal. Don't <laughs> pretend. No, because they're defending me because they're my friends. That's why. If that's the hill they want to die on, fine. But they're never going to let you uh... babysit their kids, Ross. Because they fucking know deep down you're out of it. You were fucking out of it. There's a video okay. where someone said he I'm belongs not, in his safe asylum. <laughs> he kind of yeah, I'm not gonna die on that hill. I've been friends with this guy for two years and I'm done. So is Rex. Well, then that's fine, Neil. And you know what? Honestly, Neil, I'm also done with your shit as well. Why in the fuck did I try to Ross, fucking just... avoid you all the fucking time, Neil? You fat fuck. Ross, <laughs> this, none of this would have happened if you hadn't DMCA'd me and fucking targeted me. Ross, you're literally yeah, fat too, right. by the way. You know what I shouldn't have done? I should have never fucking... I never should have gotten to the point where I was like gonna say, yeah, I'm gonna involve Rex in it. I never should have involved him in this shit. That's the one thing I fucking take accountability for. Well, then why did you yeah. take target? Exactly. No, Ross, like we yeah, can't... Ross, Ross, here's, here's what fucking floors me about you, man, is you, you take... Somebody might say you're fat. Okay, let's just use that as an example. Let's say somebody says that to you. Your reaction to that... Yeah, you hear that a lot, don't you, Ryan? <laughs> yeah, okay, Gerpy. 
uh, your reaction to that, Ross, is to find out who they are, where they live, what they do, and how can you hurt them. That's and, how and, you react. Yeah. Nuclear it's friends when I'm back. Hey, when, hey when, Rex, when Rex called my stream gay, did I fucking try to find out where he lived? No. No, I but didn't. you, you, you sparked out done? about it. The person in this call has been doxxed. It's sent death threats right I haven't. Oh yeah, well that's 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 I, I take that into accountability. Yeah, I kind of did because like you know, I guess you know Ross is a spurg, so you know you are. But like I was gonna say earlier that like you, you take everything given to you for granted. Like you've had like friends you could talk to about shit, and you, and you just end up like burning bridges. It isn't like you have one or two instances of spurgery or, or doing really nefarious, malicious, vicious shit to people. You have years and years. And over a dozen accounts of doing this on the you do it on a on a monthly uh, basis. I make my own decisions, and it's well documented. And your and your decisions get you in these situations. And this time you're not going to come back. It's uh, except I will, and this is an over boon. Just saying. No, see this? Bro, bro, that's, 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 that's bro. That's just gonna get you in another situation like this. Medicare and Kiwi Farms are mocking your ass. You are not gonna come back from this alive, dude. I'm metaphorically uh, speaking. Uh, dude, are you threatening to destroy me or something? This, no, this, I'm not uh, threatening to destroy you. What are you gonna do, Ross? Are you gonna get nuclear to get his friend to get his friend to dox you or whatever? I'm just saying you made a fool out of no, yourself no. so many times, Ross. But, like, this is the biggest instance. Like, there's a bunch of people fucking watching. Uh, yeah, well, you're something. I'm, I'm a very notorious you're person, you're something. and, you're something. I'm and you know, I put my- I put my- I put- baby, I put baby, myself baby, in baby, shit every day. Hey, hey Ruby abandoned you. Hey, hold on, hold on. Yeah, well, here- here's the funniest thing. What's the funniest thing? You got- you got- <laughs> is, is that- is that pretty much, no matter what, like, you- you can never stop me from having friends, so... That's third okay. decision. No, yeah, Ross, you nobody needs to. You stop yourself from having friends yeah. by being yeah. weird bullshit. I never tried to. You do that on no. your own, buddy. Okay. Okay. What did you call me? Hole. What? Don't don't call me that. Call her That's again. Sweet. Call her a hole. Say she's a hole. I want to hear her reaction. Dude, I, <laughs> dude I'm, I'm sure. welcoming you into this stream out of my own hospitality, dude. How many, how many times do I have to shit in your living room before you throw me off, Ross? Brandon, because I'm, I'm not Brandon. Ross, throw him out. <laughs> All right, throw fine, me out, Ross. You, you had, fine, you had your, you had your chance. Okay, okay. enjoy your back. Back. I'm not being civil, throw get, him out. Uh, have a good time with your pedal chat. <laughs> hey, yeah, yeah, whatever, shut the fuck up. Oh, it was an honor having you right, on. You were yeah. uh, an honor having you <laughs> on as well. Fuck you, Oh dude. my god. That was amazing. <laughs> Mr. Mediker would go on to do a follow-up stream on his backup channel a few days later, and would end up doing two Ross videos that September. Despite these incidents, Ross stayed online and kept streaming to his YouTube channel. He even attempted to commit suicide at one point, but could only find Febreze. Now, after the video had come out, Ross decided to do his own stream. A little different than Nuclear's. He wasn't talking about how hard he was winning. He was just gonna drink bleach. I never said this was intended to be a suicide stream anyways. I didn't officially call it that. This was actually fucking uh, me just drinking Febreze. I was able to drink Febreze, alright? Unlike you fucking faggots. I don't know, I literally tried to kill myself live on stream. This is embarrassing, honestly. Yeah, I, I mean, I did. And I tried to pretty much end my own life, pretty much. <laughs> Ross would also frequently be seen streaming with YouTuber Tomba Hat, and occasionally stream with someone called Nuclear Gamer. Cares. We're just gonna win in the end anyway. Once NSP's Sorry, back, if they still haven't backed off and moved on and grown up, then we know what the end will be. Yeah, dude, we have like a lot of hackers with us, so therefore that means, uh. No, dude. Okay. First off, don't even say that. 
these guys only do it for good reason, which there is a good enough reason right here. Alone. Exactly. This is harassment. But, but once we have enough evidence, we show it to them. Because we've already won this, dude. We don't need to get them involved with this. And so far, dude, I'm not going to tell NSP to go after a rod. Ah, crap. That came out wrong. I'm not going to tell NSP to go after Logan because he's not threatening to dox people. Same for Boone, which he claims that I said I was because he's freaking pathetic. I might have slipped it out once or twice, maybe, while I wasn't paying attention or something. But Ginger Fidus is the one target for NSP. In a lot of these streams, Ross would try to convince Nuclear that he was in the right and that Medicare was just a bully picking on an innocent autistic kid. This resulted in an easily avoidable feud between Nuclear Gamer and Medicare. If not for the fact that 10 hours later, I was put on fucking notice when this video went live on YouTube. Medicare, I suggest you back off before I contact YouTube and let them know that you're witch hunting a user and that will permanently have you banned. That and your content, I mean, the fact that your intro is cringy as shit. So if you want to keep defending them and call Ross a pedo and witch hunt him, I'll gladly have your channel banned. Because I mean, witch hunting is against the TOS, and that's all they can do. That's right. Death himself, Nuclear Gamer, is putting me on notice. No more Salem of the Internet for you, Jim. You can't hunt these witches anymore. So it's either you show evidence, or you could find out what happens if you keep messing with me and my group. You just don't get to play on the internet anymore because you will be in prison. Oh, I forgot to mention, that police report is real. And I'll be sending it in if this does not start uh, of course, of resolving course. itself. You really uh, fucked up now, buddy. So uh, you got one choice, you can show the evidence or I can get Interpol involved. International police forces are coming for you, Medica. And my buddies, Bandito and Severon, the part of my Call of Duty clan, Medica. You can't just say things on the internet that hurt my feelings. They're coming for you. That's cyber harassment. I'm gonna uh, have to take your internet away, Medica, after Interpol gets involved. How dare you make fun of somebody looking up pictures of kids in a bathtub? I'm gonna have the police come over and look at his computer. I'm sure everything's gonna go well when he does that in Bandito. My best friend in Severon. They're gonna super hack you, Medica. No more internet for you. After over a month of public meltdowns, denying the accusations of pedophilia, and threats to dox and hack people, someone finally called Ross's grandmother. This resulted in Ross once again losing his internet access.